Assembling components by using the constraint tool. The symmetry constraint. So we're going to go up and we're going to go to the relationships panel in the assembly tab and we're going to choose constraint tool. In the constraint tool, we're in the assembly tab. We're going to choose the type of constraint as symmetry. We're going to select the first item. So I'm going to pick the first item. I'm going to pick on this face here to be symmetrical. It jumps over to the number two selection. I'm going to pick on this face over here. And now I'm going to choose the third symmetry plane. So I'm going to pick this work plane I've created. And you can see that it forces the object to be symmetrical about the two. All right. So it's symmetrical about the plane. I'll apply. And I placed a symmetric constraint on these two objects. And they are symmetrical about this work plane. So um, in this particular case, the idea is to make objects or components symmetrical of each other by using the constraint, uh, I mean the symmetry uh, type in the constraint tool.